Good morning, this is meteorologist Mark Cunningham with the National Weather Service in San Angelo, Texas, and this weather briefing is being updated Thursday, April 24, 2014 at 5.30 a.m. The next active round of uh, weather will be across the area on Saturday. The uh, a combination of a strong upper level storm system moving out into the Plain States and a uh, surface dry line will bring uh, thunderstorms uh, first developing uh, across our western areas late in the afternoon and then moving east and becoming more numerous during the nighttime hours. And those conditions are uh, very favorable for uh, some uh, severe thunderstorms uh, Saturday afternoon and Saturday night. And it looks like the uh, main impacts will be a large hail and damaging winds and also isolated tornadoes are possible. So uh, check back with us to uh, get the latest information on this uh, possible severe weather outbreak uh, Saturday afternoon and Saturday night. Now if your plans call for travel uh, uh, this weekend into early next week, uh, by Sunday into, uh, into Monday, uh, an outbreak of severe weather will be possible Sunday across the central and southern plains, uh, mainly east of the I-35 corridor. And this will include uh, uh, possible tornadoes. And then further east on Monday across the uh, uh, middle and lower Mississippi Valley for potential, again, for severe weather. And looking, and looking at the weather for today across West Central Texas, weather looks nice with uh, uh, sunny to partly cloudy skies with highs in the 80s. And for uh, Friday, we're looking at, uh, again, uh, unseasonably warm temperatures with sunny skies, highs in the upper 80s to lower 90s. And remember, right now, uh, West Central Texas is in, currently in the peak of severe weather season. And this will continue into the month of May. So it's a good idea to have a plan of action in place to protect yourself and your family. Thank you for listening to this weather briefing and have a great day.